William Frazier is a piece of garbage. And uh, I want people to remember this face. This is the face of a hero. Jerry Adams, Martin McGinnis, they're traitors and just as bad as Ian Paisley, or Ian Paisley Jr. The only thing I agree with William Frazier on is that um, Yeah, Ian, Ian Paisley and Ian Paisley Jr. are scum, and that the Good Friday Agreement was a treachery. Um, but he has no idea what the future holds. Um, occupation breeds resistance. There are plenty of people in Boston, in Chicago, in New York, ready and willing and able to fund, to volunteer, if the Protestants rise up and start slaughtering people like the Shankill Butchers did, like the UVF did, just killing Catholics indiscriminately to the, <clears throat> did the non-infiltrated provisionals indiscriminately kill Protestants? No. It was the likes of Freddie, uh, Freddie Scapatici who killed Catholic and Protestant alike. Um, and the British agents. What did the IRA do? And the the, re, the true provision was before Jerry Adams got a hold of them. They went after RUC and British Army. That's it. Man with gun in his hand. And those collaborating with them. They didn't go and just slaughter Protestants. The Irish Catholic has no, no uh, hatred towards the, the Protestant. But I'd ask William Fraser, why does he have a hatred against the Irish Catholic? Why, for what reason does he want to see Irish Catholics slaughtered? Why was the 18, or the, sorry, the 14 men in Derry that were butchered why was that justified? He praises the UDR in the B or UDA, B specials and uh, the RUC. So uh, what the hell happened in Derry? What happened in Derry in '69? Answer me that.